what is up everyone <clears throat> so it's early as fuck um it's 8 21 i woke up at about like 2 3 this morning and it's because i slept all day yesterday I don't know how or when, but I got sick um, yesterday, and it was more or less just sick to my stomach, and I threw up a lot, and I felt like shit, and I was just thinking about the video I recorded last night and just like damn the only time I don't seem or act like I'm fucking crazy is when I'm high as fuck <laughs> or just like exhausted or just like fucked up pretty much but um yeah, it's early as fuck. I thought, shit, I still got that champagne flavored thing. Why not? And about that time, I heard housekeeping. So I was like, why not? You know, all these things leading up to me when I wanted to record the video. Just... Oh, should I, or mm, do I really need to, or damn, this is going to be stupid, I shouldn't do this. So here we are. Cheers. I think I'm gonna do it because just like me doing this video and looking like shit and all that I'll just make the excuse why the fuck not you know what I'm saying Thank you, thank you. Fireflame is the guest in the back. He is the, uh, I don't know, the sound engineer. Okay. So here we go. It says bang. And bang is exactly what I want to do right now. Bang my head against the fucking wall till I pass out for another 24 hours. Anyways, let's get it. Bang. Champagne. I know what I'm doing wrong. Give me a second. No, it is not wine. It is champagne. And this is all I got. 
but fuck it. Let me go wash it. And let's try this one. Here we go. Here we go. Bang. Champagne. That echoed so much. It's just like a dragon. Or is that a lion? Tiger? I don't know. It was very intimidating. It's clear. I don't know how I feel about that. Because from champagnes I've drunk. You know, the clearish, you know, clearish, yellowish, you know, somewhere around there. This just looks, yeah, it does kind of got like champagne color. I'm not going to smell it. I'm not, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going <sighs> to, Illuminati. I'm just gonna Illuminati, you know what I'm saying? Cheers. It's starting to calm down. smell it so bad but fuck it <coughs> we're just going in okay it's not bad not bad it's it's a sweet it's sweet champagne um if anyone has had the champagne jelly beans it is very very similar to that taste get the taste of champagne and then you get the taste of, like sweet very sweet I'm pouring this <clears throat> some people may be like Fred it must be pretty good you're pouring it up again no I, I kind of just want a Red Bull and I'm low on Red Bull because I bought abundance of Red Bull and when I have abundance of something I usually eat or drink or do that thing in abundance and I am low on Red Bull. So, with that being said, I was like, shit. That might wake me up. That might get me good. That might get me right. You know? If not, shit, we could have a fight. At night. While on a kite. 
and I don't know. I basically just want something to wake me up, and uh, yeah, I could tell instantly from just taking a sip. Wow, I am really dependent on energy drinks. <laughs> Nothing I didn't already know. Um, other than that, how are y'all doing? Like, let me know. Um, how's everyone feeling? You know, what are you doing to pass time? I really had a hard time recently just figuring out what is my pastime, what I do in my free time. Because before this whole thing going on, I didn't have much free time. I didn't have time to record music. I didn't have time to do this. So I'm starting to come to the realization of you got the time, motherfucker, just do it. And if you don't do it, or can't do it, or don't want to do it, it must not be something you really want to do that much. And, you know, that hurts me a lot, because music is something I do care about, and I do want to do, but I do feel like there is a certain age you get where you just can't be as creative or as open-minded or experimental or just artistic as you once were when you were younger because Younger people, kids, they have this incredible imagination. And sometimes I feel like I lost that. Even though it hasn't been that long, I know it's something that has been, it's been building up. I think it first started in San Antonio, and it all boils down to I'm grown, I have my own place, I have my own bills, you know, I need to help myself, I can't do this, or I don't have time for that, and that's not always the case, it's more or less just society and everything else I've heard growing up like shit you're wasting your time you know who cares you know this and that to where nowadays I'll catch myself saying the same things it's not something I really believe you know like, for example, when Power Flame just keeps on talking and I, I'm just not in the mood to hear it, I might say, <clears throat> cool story, I don't care. You know, I'm being a fucking dick, bro. And truth be told, I do care. You know, truth be told, someone cares, you know what I'm saying? It's just the way I was raised, and everyone's raised different, but at the end of the day, there is a difference between the mindset of someone who is, you know, I don't want to say living off someone, but someone who is dependent on someone more or less than there is someone who is fully dependent on themselves. 
if that makes sense. I feel like I'm just talking nonsense a lot. I know I'm not. It's just. I don't know. And even though I got fucking fire flame and shit, like, I still wake up. Just like. I don't know how to explain it. I'm afraid to go to sleep in the sense I'm afraid I will miss something, someone will die, or I'll die in my sleep. I wake up and I wake up in like a panic. Just like I gotta find someone, I gotta I gotta know that everyone's okay, I gotta know like nothing's changed. And like, I don't know. I had a girl hit me up, like, last night or something. She had called me, and then she had texted me, like, okay, because I'd missed her call. I said I was sick yesterday, or day before, whatever, and she was, like, to put in more context, me and this girl have not talked in a few days, so her calling me was pretty much out of the blue. So, I woke up, and I, I was kind of, like, starting to have a panic attack and just like trying to figure out everything and trying to talk to someone really so I had seen that she called and texted I called her back and I was just like what was that about and it's a bad habit of mine but I'll come aggressive at someone so someone has to come defensive at me so more or less they feel like they're defending their self and not having a conversation with me, more or less. And <clears throat> I don't know. She uh she's going through her own situation. She recently had a kid. And I just called her out the fucking blue like someone is me right now. Hey, speak of the fuck though. Bubbling this.